So, I don't know what else to do. All the doors are locked. I don't know how to open the clock. And I can't look around because there's too many fucking enemies. And I have no healing items. Fun. Fun. Oh, shit. A key on the ground on the other side of the bars. If I stretch my arm out, I might be able to reach it. I needed the flashlight to get this. <clears throat> That's right, don't look. Just grab. <laughs> you bitch! Hey, ow. <laughs> hey, wait! Damn it. What a bitch. Well, I can't reach it no matter how far I stretch. Who's that kid? What a bitch! All right, so. Thank you, Cornchie, for a 50 bit cheer. He's a pyramid head, believe in you. What I need to do is get to the other staircase, right? Find a way to the other side. Yeah. Obi Wan Kenobi cheer. I said, I like to play games on hard or easy. Oh, normal or easy, so I can enjoy them and not rage. I don't know why people like hard games. To me, playing game is where you can enjoy a game. <clears throat> God damn it. Well, considering I have no health or healing items, I guess I should save. Because if I die now, it's going to be fucked. Pigatich just resell for the 20th month in a row and said, Gives me some more of that spooky goodness, DSP. Alright, let me save. Okay. It's still locked, I bet. Yep. <sighs> that douche kid said the reason I, I wanted you to play it on hard is because it's actually more scary because the enemies are threatening. Yeah, but dude, there's a difference between, oh, the enemy is threatening versus, oh, there's seven enemies in this hallway and you have to hit them 25 times each. By the way, you can't hit them because the fucking melee mechanics suck and now you can't even progress in the fucking game. There's a big difference. <clears throat> yeah, see, I don't know. I, don't, I have no idea. What I need to do is get to that staircase, but I don't know how to open the clock. If I remember correctly, you find a way to open the clock, right? You open the clock, you do the puzzle, get you into 209, let you go down the staircase, which then lets you go through the hallway on the third floor and get the key. And then eventually you push that garbage with something, and it allows you to go get an item downstairs. But I don't remember how to get into the clock at all. Yeah, I don't remember how to do this. I don't know how to get in the clock. What was that? Some kind of noise north of here. Hello. It's Pyramid Head. Yep, it's Pyramid Head. It's pretty creepy, completely blood red, right? <clears throat> oh shit ah. Hello oh, God. Who He's 
Jade, who could have done this? Aha! Now the key to room 202 has appeared. So now I gotta go back to room 202. Yep. Oh, great. That was fair. I'm just trying to run by them. Now I have no health. I'm dying. Great. My controller's vibrating because I have no health. You got a health drink. Great. Amazing. Now I'm only blinking red instead of blood red. Toxic Droilet Juice Cheer says if you turn off the flashlight and walk by them, they won't see you. That's wrong. Because I did do that before, and they still saw me. Because this is hard difficulty, not normal. Locked. Too dark to tell for sure, but I think there's something on the other side of the hole. Investigate. Always stick your hands through holes. Remember huh? that. Whoa, some dick. A glory hole. <laughs> it's a, a big pyramid head dick. The clock key. There's nothing in the hole anymore. Okay. That's one giant glory hole. Pyramid Head must really be well endowed. The body with dead butterflies on the ground. There's nothing else of interest here. Nothing inside the cage. Alright, I guess we're done. I got the clock key. I can go back. I'll turn the flashlight off. I gotta use the light again. Alright. Wait, can you turn it on and off without the menu? Oh, circle. Circle turns it on and off. I didn't know that. That's good. Thank you to Wildlife Chris who just who uh, suggested that in the stream chat. So 1129 and 15 seconds. How do I use the key? Here we go. Uh. So it said that the stubby one was, was, was to the left, and it said that uh, the long one was to the upper right, so probably one. There it is. There it is. Now I should be able to push it. 
Yep. All right, new room. All right, we're the, the next room over. 209. Locked. Ah, I actually got to a save room. Okay, I'm making a new save. I'm going to try to tough through this on hard, guys, but just to warn you, this is probably going to be a rage-inducing, very annoying playthrough for me and not fun now because it's so insanely difficult. <clears throat> okay. Well, at least I'm not in the fucking red anymore. Okay. Okay. 